Friday was the last day in the office for many of Taiwan's local leaders, including Taipei Mayor Ke Wenzhe, who packed up his belongings at City Hall surrounded by reporters. Many of the items in his office caught the reporters' attention, including a volume on cross-strait affairs by President Lai Ching, uh, Tsai Ing-wen and a backhanded gift he had received from a city councillor. <laughs> Taipei Mayor Ke Wenzhe puts on his doctor's white coat for the first time in eight years, saying he's heading back to National Taiwan University Hospital. Friday was his last day of work as mayor and gave the media a tour of his resting quarters at Taipei City Hall. I just lounge over here as I don't have the habit of taking afternoon naps. I'll leave the coat hangers here for Zhang Wanan. Ke packed up the books on his shelves, reminiscing about his time in office. <laughs> Among the books packed was a volume by Tsai Ing-wen on cross-strait affairs, which Ke says will be read in the future. He also commented on the Taipei City Council's recent passage of a budget for video surveillance systems to be used by the city's police department. Ko had protested that the rules for using the budget were too restrictive, but his request for the budget to be reassessed was vetoed. After a proposal to reconsider the bill was blocked, the police department wrote to me asking what they could do. I said corporations are colluding with the city council to scam the country. That's what I'll write on the announcement. Over in his office, there were also plenty of memories. One of them was a foldable bicycle gifted to Ke by Councillor Wang Shijian to criticize Ke for making a big spectacle of his bike trips. Ke says he plans to ride the bike to NTU Hospital on Monday. <laughs> <laughs> Ke said the bike was very handy, adding that he would welcome Wang to the Taiwan People's Party if he gets kicked out of the DPP, as Wang has recently been very critical of Premier Su Chen Chang. <laughs> I'll wait for him to get kicked out of the DPP. That should be happening soon, ha ha ha. I think with the things he's been saying, he's going to get the boot soon. Even on his last day at the office, Kirk captured much media attention, which is surely to follow him in the future.